Hello guys, today I'm going to show you how you um, license transfer on the Xbox One. Uh, the main reason you do this is to swap games between friends so you can have the games that they've got. It can only be done, I've heard three times a year and I've heard two, I'm not sure which one it is. So it could be it could be either of those or it could be none of those. Uh, basically we need to go to my games and apps. Uh, go to apps. Across to your settings. Right, as you can see this is red and it's got my profile on it. Yeah? Right, so now what we're going to do is we're going to go to the home screen. We're going to go up to here. And we're going to sign in as my friend who has bought all the games, basically. Um, if You need to have a friend who owns the games to license transfer, otherwise it won't work. Um, and they've got to be able to trust you with their account. Uh, so you click choose this person, because I've already typed in his password. It'll sign me in as Owen. Um, we go back into his settings. And now it says his name instead of mine, because we're in his account, obviously. We go to my home xbox, type in his password, guys I'm going to cut this bit of the video out. Right, and then it'll say, make this my home xbox or this is my home xbox, click that. And then once you've clicked it, it'll come up and it'll say all the same stuff, and it'll, but instead of saying this is, it'll say this is not my home xbox, so that means you've done it right. So once you've done that, press B to back out, back to the home up to sign in preferences and change back into your account so choose this person and we're back into my account then we go to my games and apps games and all these games are ready to install there now if they're not there the best thing to do is to go back to who you signed in as, change them to their profile again, and they all will be there, basically. If they're not there under yours, they'll be there under theirs. Uh, then install it, and uh, once it's installed, or one, in fact once it's installing, I think, we can change his profile back to the original that we keep on his Xbox and that way we can play with them on the games that they've transferred to us. So I will skip this part of the video again guys because I don't want you to have to watch the game installing so I will be back in a moment. Right then guys that is the download done so now all we have to do is we if you've changed your profile again which I did just to show you that you could uh, change back to my original one now I'm in my original profile, uh, go over to the games we've downloaded and uh, they'll load up and work fine. So you've got all these games to keep, you can only do the license transfer as I said either two or three times a year as far as I'm aware. Um, I haven't obviously tested this but according to what I've heard it is. Um, so yeah, uh, this is my first ever tutorial video guys, so if you could let me know if you liked it, leave a like, subscribe for more, if there's anything you guys want to know, if you want me to do a tutorial on something, if you want to ask a question, if you leave it in the description I'll do my best to find out the answer for you. Yeah.